Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're back at Downtown Disney. And I was passing by the uh, old AMC building and I noticed that they changed the banners over here. So it looks like they're, they're doing some promotion for the Oscars. This is live Sunday, April 25th, 5 p.m. And they have this one. They have this one. This one's pretty cool. And then it just starts like, repeating itself over there. But then they also changed the one over here, I guess I got the ticket booth. Those are now promoting the Oscars as well. It is currently 9.56. Downtown Disney doesn't look too bad yet. It looks okay, but they've only been open for like 10 minutes or so. <laughs> so I'm sure we'll, I'm sure in like 30 minutes it's not gonna look like this, but hopefully it's not too busy today. So I think before we uh, head to World of Disney, I think we're gonna pop into Marston's Confectionery really quick. Just so I can finally show you all the uh, the Easter cupcakes. Hopefully they have them in stock right now. All right, the first one into Marceline's today, and it looks like they're fully stocked on everything. So this time, instead of the Minnie Mouse cake pop, they have a Mickey cake pop. They have the Easter apples, the Mickey and the Minnie, and then they have some Easter cupcakes that I've been dying to show you guys. But every time I come, they're sold out, but here they are. These are really pretty. And then they still have a lot of their, their usuals, like their cookies and stuff like that. They still have the pineapple cookie as well. I'm so glad I was finally able to show you guys the Easter cupcakes and like all the other stuff they had for Easter. Uh, I asked the cast member if they're gonna have them after uh, this weekend ends because, you know, I think Sunday is Easter. And they said that they're gonna sell whatever they have left over and then they won't restock after that. So if you guys are looking for those Easter treats, make sure you guys hit Marceline's like over the weekend or soon after that. So now you guys know the drill, we're gonna hit World of Disney. I guess we just walked into World of Disney. Thank God they have the AC on again. If you guys are coming here on the weekend, make sure you guys hit World of Disney and just hang out for a little bit because it's gonna be, uh, I'm sure it's gonna be hot and it's really refreshing in here. So this is a good place to just hang out, look at the merch and just enjoy the AC. Guys, so as soon as we walked in, we were stopped by one of you and you guys were so kind. You guys were nice enough to give us this like little like gift for uh, me, Mondo, Nick, and Chris. If you guys want to check them out, their Instagram is at 17made. They were so nice to, to gift us these masks. Look at all the Mickeys on the print. This one's really cool. I love, love how it's like mainly black. So this is definitely my type of mask. Uh, thank you again. And it was really nice meeting you guys. All right, guys. So I was already told that there's no new merch today, but they still have a couple things that were hard to find before that they still have currently, like these, uh, these puzzles over here. They still have these in stock. They have. All three versions, the Finding Dory, the Wally, -E, and Coco on the bottom over there. It looks like they have tons of each, each of them. And then over here in the ear wall, next to the exit of World of Disney, they still currently have the Tweed and Pro ears in stock. So if you guys are coming here today or over the weekend, uh, you might be lucky enough to find these still. And they still have tons of the keychains. But it looks like the Alien and then the Mickey popcorn buckets are like the, the more popular ones because those are the ones that like have the least on the pegs. So yeah, I'm sure you'll, you'll be good for the weekend though. Over here in the mug section, I guess the other day they sold out of these Winnie the Pooh mugs, which I thought these were pretty cool. Look at this. It's the front and the back of Winnie the Pooh, but they are back. These are $19.99. And then over here, I showed you guys these the other day as well. They had the red Minnie Mouse cup and then her signature on the back. This one was $14.99. And now they've added Mickey Mouse as well. And this one is a black mug. This is really cool. And then this one is $14.99. That's really cool. So there's something I wasn't able to show you guys the other day because I had no idea about it, but over here in the middle room of World of Disney, in this bowl, they have a third backpack clip spinners. Look at this. This one is the teacup one. This one's probably the coolest one out of all of them just because like it's flat and it looks like the right. Look at that. I mean, it doesn't spin that fast unless you're, you're really strong, but this is awesome. I'd probably get this one out of all of them, but still, I'm kind of like, uh, $12.99. It's a little bit expensive, but. But they do have it over here in the middle room, middle section, uh, World of Disney, near like the 2020 merch. All right guys, so we're about to leave uh, World of Disney, but I want to show you guys the crowds inside of here. It is insane, like, jeez. Uh, it's like spring break, I guess. Touch of Disney, 
and it's a Friday, so but it's crazy busy in here. So right now we're in the last room near the exit, and like, just, just look. Like, it's really hard to walk through here right now because of how, like, how many people are coming in or coming out this way. See, I was not kidding, it is really busy. I think we're gonna leave World of Disney though and uh, head to Starbucks. How bad was that? Alright, guys, we're about to make our way to Starbucks and get something cold to drink because today is really warm. No, no, that's really? So, to keep us cool today, we got a grande strawberry acai with lemonade with light ice and no strawberries. I'm not a fan of the strawberries, so I just like the actual drink itself. But, huge shout out to April for getting this for us. Thank you so much, April. This is crazy, but check out the line for World of Disney. It got pretty long. It's already by like the tram area. Guys, look at that, look. The horse is on Main Street again. And they also have the, uh, the Omnibus right there. Look, it's moving right there in the center screen. And they're bringing the horse around again. This is like the, the awesome shot right here. Look at this. There goes the Omnibus. <laughs> this is so cool. Wow, this is, that's a lot of activity inside Disneyland today again. What is it pulling? Oh, it's pulling the trolley. Yeah, that's oh, awesome. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. You see a golf cart passing. That is so cool. We've been standing for like the past like, I don't know, 20 minutes or so just staring at these vehicles. Oh, and they're waving. That's awesome. That was so awesome to see like the, the transportation vehicles. That was just dang. We saw like all of them. We saw them walking horses, the, the bus, the like the carriage thing. But now we're on the other side of Disneyland's entrance and we're going to go look in, inside there. See if we can find something else. So here's a look at the right side of Disneyland. And a second ago, there was one of the vehicles passing through, but it's already going down Main Street, so we can't see it from here. But uh, I'm sure it'll come back around. But besides that, there's people walking around here and there, but nothing too crazy. Most of the action was like on the other side when we saw all the other vehicles and then the, the horse being walked. And uh, that's pretty cool. So we decided to come back to the left side of Disneyland, and we noticed that they're currently doing some work inside of Newsstand, or like the information booth. They usually just like drinks and stuff in there. Um, they're like sanitizing everything in there. We saw a couple of cast members coming in and out of there. And then as far as Main Street, we haven't seen the the, the transport vehicles passing through. So who knows if maybe they're taking a break or maybe they're done for the day. But uh, as you guys saw in the video, it did happen. They are testing all that stuff out. So we're back over here, like deep in downtown Disney and there's lines for like every store. This is Marceline's, Black Tap has a line. Salt and straw is a little bit of a line, and then there's just like a bunch of people sitting around in the shade because it's so hot today. And then here's a look at the area by Jazz Kitchen and Tortilla Joe's. You can just see the amount of people entering downtown Disney. It's crazy today. Super busy. I think we might stop somewhere and get something to eat. I'm not sure yet. All right, guys, so we decided to eat Earl of Sandwich. And I always get like the most simplest sandwich. It's just chicken, mayo, uh, okay. cheese, and bacon. So huh? super simple. And then I like the Miss Vicky's sea salt and vinegar chips. And then I got a Coke as well. This is really helping with the heat because it's so hot today. But it's a pretty good sandwich. And Earl's Sandwich is honestly, it's a really good place to eat. I highly recommend this place. It's, uh, it's a pretty good price and the food is delicious. All right, guys, so we just finished our amazing lunch at Earl's Sandwich. If you guys have not been there, definitely go and check it out. It's really good. Uh, uh, but anyways, I think I'm in the video here. If you guys did like it, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.